Hey, morning everyone. It's Tactical Dad. And I'm going to do an unboxing of a Glock 19 Gen 5 MOS. Um, before I open this up, I'm going to talk about a little bit why I got this. I did used to have a Glock 19 Gen 4 MOS. It shot well, no issues with it. And I had a red dot on it. Um, I'm the type of person where I like to sometimes trade in my guns and try to change it for another one or whatever and that's what happened with it i did eventually sell it to upgrade to different guns and you know here i am now i do have enough nine millimeter nine millimeter guns and for some reason i just still keep coming back to glock why because glock guns they always shoot whatever you can throw at it uh, it hardly has any issues and it's a proven product so here I am I'm back to Glock again I actually got some Glock fever this summer so all right let's see what's in the box all right so um, cause it three 15 round magazines and the usual mag loader. Comes with two size back straps. Uh, I would assume it's a medium and large. Put that there for now. Uh, sometimes from what I hear is a hit and miss on the uh, mounting plates. And I got lucky with this. So, um, I hear that sometimes, usually uh, Glock has just been sending one plate, but I got lucky with this and I got four plates. So, comes with the number one plate, number two plate, number three plate, and number four plate. So, you could do RMR, Holosun, Delta Point, and Shield, and I don't know the others. But yeah, I'm happy with this right here that came with it. Thank you, Glock. Comes with the usual lock. Gun lock. And the safety manual. Blah, 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 blah stuff. All right. And the cleaning kit. So, let's talk about the gun. Here she is, Glock 19 Gen 5 MOS. I bought this at my local gun store at Northwest Armory. Thank you guys. It's in Tigard, Oregon. Great bunch of guys to hang out there and just bullshit with. Can it stand just like that? Yeah, it can. Yeah. So, yeah, I went back with and had to add the Glock 19 Gen 5. I made sure I wanted a MOS. I've been always wanting a MOS Glock 19. I already have a Glock uh, 45 non-MOS, which you saw earlier in one of my videos, because I wanted something different. But definitely when I got back to getting a Glock 19, I wanted to make sure it's MOS. I'm not sure yet what kind of red dot I have to put on there, but I have a whole bunch of different type of red dots to use. Alright, so, let's pop the magazine, check, check, nothing in the chamber, alright. Oh, also, <clears throat> uh, one note of difference of the Gen 4 versus the Gen 5. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but the uh, trigger is slightly better than the Gen 4. Gen 5 versus Gen 4, the trigger is slightly better than the Gen 4. I did have a Glock 19X, which I loved, and I also saw that. I, I do regret it, so I guess I got this to make up for it. Let's do a trigger test. I guess we could do it this way. Oh. 
I'm not used to it this way. It's actually a decent trigger. I do intend to probably leave the trigger alone. I think all I want to do with it is just add a red dot to it. That's all I want to do to it. So, yeah, this is it. Glock 19, Gen 5, MOS, all black in all its glory. Dependable, accurate as it can be, as what the shooter can be, and it eats anything. I trust my life with this, definitely. Oh, one thing to note out about this as well is this uh, cover plate. What's different about it versus the Gen 4s? It's actually plastic. So, yeah. Whatever. I am going to replace it anyway. And it comes with the usual cheap sights, which I'll probably replace with higher sights. Alright. Thanks for watching. Um, hope you liked the video. Please like and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching. Alright. Peace out.